Okay, next I wanna deal with adding pages before we start editing them. So we start out with one page on our website. Some sites, if you're making them really quickly, you may just wanna have a, a one page site to, to give out quick information about an event or something of that nature. But most of the time we're gonna to wanna to have pages, right? So it's pretty simple to notice that this right pane over here is where we will add stuff. That's our three giant menu options. So we're gonna start with pages. And you'll notice that we have our home page. And notice that it says home, even though I've named it home page. Um, to add up another page, I simply click the plus sign. And I will name it whatever I like. I'm going to name this one um, class information. That's always the first one I would add um, to my site. And I'm going to click done. You notice that it takes me to this page, but it also adds it over here. Whenever you add a page like this, notice that it adds it to your nav menu too. So every page you add like that will be added across here, across the top. And I can use this to navigate just like my audience will to go back and forth between my home and my class information. I may also want to add a sub page to class information, maybe something that holds my syllabus or my class rules or something that um, warrants its own page. Maybe it doesn't fit on my class information page later. So the way I add a sub page is I hover over whatever page I want and I get the triple dot menu over here, the three dot menu. I click it and I can just click add sub page and it works the same way as before. I'm going to call it rules, but now it's going to shove it or indent it underneath the class information page just a little bit and notice that it does not appear in the navigation, but it appears as a little drop down when I hover over its parent page in navigation. If I don't even want that, if I want this page to be linked later, like it's gonna be a link to a page from my class information page, I just don't want it to appear here. Maybe you've done this a bunch of times and this menu is getting really long and you just don't want it in the way anymore. Or maybe it's something you use in parts of the year that you don't use all year. You can hover over any page you like, click on the three dot menu and hit hide from navigation. That is not deleting the page. It's just hiding it from navigation. So you will get this little crossed out emblem on the page and it will not appear in the menu. So the page does exist. Nobody will find it unless you've linked it to another page somewhere else. So that's the basic structure of your navigation over here. Anything that shares a vertical line with the home page is going to appear in navigation unless you hide it. Anything that's indented under a page with a little triangle that you can toggle on and off is a sub page. That's it for now.